This is Matrix Lord 212, and I'm talking about uh, Forest of the Dead episode of Doctor Who, um, the last uh, uh, appearance of River Song, uh, where she dies and her essence goes into the library matrix. Uh, now, I got this question I'm going to pose to you as well as uh, Dr. Freedom, uh, and that is if River Song is a Time Lord. Uh, she has regenerated, she has two hearts. Um, how could the doctor leave her body there uh, when with all the Time Lords they have to burn them so that way no one could have uh, the Time Lord DNA, no one could copy it, no one could use that. Um, they stated this in um, the opening uh, series of uh, Series 6, The Impostor Astronaut. The impossible astronaut, or even Ripper Song says, she has to burn the doctor so no one can get his DNA because uh, Time Lords are, are their their body makeup is special, uh, and you know if anybody possessed that, uh, they could probably make an army of Time Lords. So, um, don't you think that the doctor would return? Uh, to Forest of the Dead, and if he didn't restore River, he would have to somehow destroy uh, her remains. So uh, this is a question I'm posing to Dr. Freedom. Um, do you think that because of this fact, uh, the Doctor will return to Forest of the Dead? Uh, episode, I'm sorry, a silence in the library. He'll, he'll return to the library to save River Song. Um, so I just thought about that, and I thought, you know what, uh, it, it, it has to you know, the doctor has to return to the library. He has to at some point in time. Um, you know, and, and this will be a perfect way to save River. Um, because, you know, back then he didn't know that she was a Tarn Lord. He didn't know that she could regenerate. Uh, so when he left it there and she died, like her body was left there. So um, now that he knows that she's a Tarn Lord, uh, they would have to go back um, and make sure Madame Corvarian or nobody else um, is able to take DNA from that. So. All right, uh, that's it for now, so take care.